With going green slowly becoming the new mantra for transportation around the world, the electric car is slowly getting more attention. And Chinese car makers are taking big strides in developing such vehicles. Porter Liu Yang brings us more from the 2013 Chengdu Motor Show in southwest China. Greener, cleaner and cheaper. A new model of an electric car has been exhibited at the 2013 Chengdu Motor Show and already it is the center of attraction. For sure, I will consider to buy one because it is not only eco-friendly, but energy saving. If there are enough charging stations out there, I will consider purchasing the electric car. In comparison to the gasoline-powered vehicle, the electric car uses innovative technology. But for the consumers, it is still at the entry level in terms of understanding of this vehicle. Costs for the average electric vehicle in China range from 200 to 400,000 yuan, a little bit higher than ordinary vehicles of the same class. But think of it this way. In many cities now, both the state and local governments provide subsidies for new green energy vehicles. Taking the E50 model as an example, the electric vehicle is subject to a total cash rebate of 100,000 yuan from the central government and the Shanghai municipal government. It is also exempt from the city's public play license fee. But this is not the end of the benefits from the electric vehicle like this. Experts at a charging station do the math for us. One electric vehicle charging four hours can run for about 300 kilometers depending on the battery consumption level. This costs about 60 yuan. A gasoline-powered car running for 300 kilometers costs at least 170 yuan, almost three times the cost of electric vehicles. But after you have purchased the vehicle, finding a charging station can become a huge issue. We now have over 13 charging stations in the province, but mainly for the public transit bus, government-owned electric vehicles, and garden sprinkler vehicles. Experts say it is this lack of charging stations for private-owned cars that is making it difficult for electric cars from becoming popular in China. The safety of the electric vehicle battery and driving mileage are the two unsolved issues. With the world's few prices at the mercy of world events and financial shocks, is it time now for the electric car to take the lead and blaze a new trail in the family car segment? It is hard to say. Possibly a case of wait and watch. Liu Yang, CCTV, Sichuan Province.